You may already know that there are many important parts inside a computer, but what exactly do they do? Let's take a look inside and learn about the various components that make a computer work. Whether it's a desktop computer or a laptop, every computer has a large circuit board called a motherboard. This contains some of the most important parts of the computer, such as the CPU, also known as the Central Processing Unit, or processor. The CPU can be considered the brain of the computer because it processes information and carries out commands. Since it tends to get hot, it's covered by a piece of metal called a heatsink, which draws heat away from the processor. The motherboard also contains the computer's RAM, or random access memory. This is the short-term memory that the computer uses whenever it's performing calculations. However, you cannot store your files there, because the RAM is cleared when you shut off the computer. The hard drive provides long-term storage, keeping all of the computer's data even when it's turned off. Many hard drives use a magnetic platter to store data, but many newer computers have solid-state drives, which are faster and more durable, but also more expensive. On many desktop computers, the motherboard has expansion slots that allow you to upgrade by adding expansion cards. You can add a video card to get better graphics performance, or you can add a wireless card to connect to your wireless home network. Most laptops, however, don't have expansion slots. Of course, the computer's components need electricity to run. The power supply unit is designed to take power from the wall outlet and send it to all of the different components that need power. Laptops also contain a built-in battery that lets you use them anywhere. A computer is a pretty complex machine, but now that you've seen what goes on inside, it should be a little less mysterious. GCF Global, creating opportunities for a better life.